Last year was Canada's most destructive wildfire season in recorded history. The scale of the fires, global smoke effects, the length of the season, and the national impacts all contributed to the worst season that Canadians have ever seen. Smoke and ash impacted air quality across North America and beyond. The effects of the fires became an international public health issue requiring guidance from medical professionals in both the U.S. and Europe, and the impacts on Canadians were severe. For the first time in history, an entire capital city of our territory was evacuated. That's almost 20,000 people from Yellowknife. The destruction was devastating. A total of 15 million hectares were burned, including 4 million hectares in less than four months alone. To put those numbers into perspective, that is well over seven times, and I'll repeat, seven times the annual average. And it took a Team Canada approach and international help from 12 different countries to help fight the fires, to help limit the impact. Now, I want to provide you with an update on the upcoming 2024 wildfire season based on the best available data that we have right now. Currently, we know that there are several uh, concerning trends. Southern Alberta, British Columbia, and Southern Ontario are facing extreme drought conditions. And we are expecting above normal temperatures all across the country, which, will, which is actually leading to uh, early snow melts. All these elements create conditions for a wildfire season like the last. And more to that, the temperature trends are very concerning. With the heat and dryness across the country, we can expect that the wildfire season will start sooner and end later and potentially be more explosive. 